What's up, boys? We're taking a look at some more NFL player props today over on Prize Picks. We are covering the London game between the Green Bay Packers and the New York Giants. Thursday was an amazing day. We hit the play in the video, and we also had a complete sweep over on the Patreon. We cashed big time. Got a ton of new numbers, by the way, on the Patreon from my last video, and a lot of you guys joining, and we killed it. Full sweep on the very first day of a lot of new people joining. So, yeah, everyone was very, very happy with me, I will say. Uh, in the research that we had going into that game. So $10.99 a month, NFL, all sports, $59.99 a month. I believe in week three when it comes to Thursday night and Monday night football slates, we swept both of those days. We've just been killing it, especially on Thursday nights and Monday night football. We have been absolutely killing it. Even with a crappy game like the Colts game, 4-0 sweep. It was amazing. We cashed a four-pick power play. But I got a free play for you guys in today's video. And if you guys are not on prize picks, I highly recommend joining. Tons of value on the board for sure when you guys sign up for prize picks. 100% deposit match up, up to $100 using my code D. OMG. The link is down in the description below, as well as the Patreon link that is down in the description below as well. But let's hop in and talk about one of the player props here for this London slate. So again, it's Green Bay and the and the uh, New York Giants. So Packers, Giants. Let's take a look though at uh, this game. So 9:30 in the morning here. So I will say odds may change on this prop that I'll be showing you guys because I'm recording this on a Friday night. So do keep that in mind. Always tell Tron Ritz look into these more on your own. So Green Bay is favored by minus eight. The line is minus 370 and the over under is at 41. So I will say, I think this game, even with the spread being at minus eight, I think there is a shot that it stays close a good amount of the time just because the over under is at 41. So that could be, you know, something to kind of take into account, which is why I'm kind of liking this prop right here. We're going to have two receptions. And I like, uh, again, this is value that I've only seen on prize picks so far. Randall Cobb over two receptions. There's a couple different reasons for this. Only only website out there that I've seen that have had that it has Randall Cobb at two receptions. So I love the spot here right here for Randall Cobb. And there's a couple reasons for it, like I said. So this quote from Aaron Rodgers, he says he looks like 2016 Randall. So Aaron Rodgers stresses more opportunities for Packers Randall Cobb. He said pretty much that he wants Randall Cobb on the field more. He wants him to see more opportunities. And uh, yeah, so that's what that said in my article. He definitely wants Randall Cobb to be on the field more. And he actually has been trusting him. And on top of that, he is two for two this season with two pushes. He has not missed this prop yet this season. So you have great odds because this is a plus 100 on the sports books that I was looking at. He's a plus 100 at the time of this recording to go over two and a half receptions. That is great odds for being bumped down to two on prize picks. So you have that, you have great odds. You have that quote from Aaron Rodgers, and he has not missed at all yet this season. Two for two with two pushes. That is why I'm liking this prop. Look into these more on their own, tail run risk. But that's really why I'm liking some round of cop today. Over two receptions against the New York Giants. So I think there's a good shot. Again, the over under that was a little bit lower, which could mean that they pass the ball a little bit more. And pay attention when you guys are watching this game to the third downs, because on third down is where Randall Cobb gets most of his catches. So if you guys are watching the game, pay attention to those third downs if you will be taking this Randall Cobb prop right here. So that's one of the ones I'm definitely liking for this slate. Tons of more plays will be going up on the Patreon uh, probably Saturday night-ish, I will say. I think Saturday night I'll probably have the NFL slate up on the board. I may have some again Sunday morning. I might have this up actually midday Saturday. We'll see when I end up uh, finishing off all my research. But again, Patreon link is down in the description below. $10.99 a month for NFL. All sports is $15.99 a month if you guys are interested. But you guys know, take a look at his game log here. You guys can see his targets, all that different stuff. And by the way, if you guys are not already, subscribe to the channel and leave a like on the video. Seriously, would appreciate it. Turn on the post notifications so you guys do not miss out on my other videos. I have another video coming, by the way, that is the Sunday Night Football Slate. And also just the complete Sunday slate, which will give you guys two picks in that video. So really, I'm giving you guys four picks over here on YouTube and plenty, plenty more will be up over on the Patreon. But anyways, we take a look at the targets here. He's had three, three, two, and four. So the reason why Rogers likes Cobb, by the way, is because he catches when he's targeted. He gets those catches when he's targeted. And that's seen by these numbers right here. You know, he's had, uh, what is that? Five, eight, ten. Tar he's had 10 catches on how many? I don't know, 12 targets. So He's caught, he's got a ball on 10 out of 12 targets this season. So yeah, Randall Cobb is one of the guys that I'm definitely looking forward to uh, for his prop right here. So hopefully you guys did enjoy today's field. That is uh, really what I'm liking right there for Randall Cobb. We take a look at some other leans and things like that uh, though. So you have like the one o'clock games with Justin Jefferson, Evans, Diggs, and Cup uh, for half a touchdown. I'm waiting for some tackle plus assist props to go on the board. I will say I'm definitely interested in looking for some tackle plus assist props. Those have been killing it for me. Uh, for sure. I've been loving some tackle plus assist props. You have uh, passing touchdown props here with Jalen Hurts over one half passing touchdowns or, or under. Uh, Matthew Stafford, one half passing touchdowns. Derek Carr, Bridgewater, Dalton 
all these different guys. You got Dalton that one and a half touchdowns against Seattle. So that's a little bit interesting right there. You have interceptions on the board here. Daniel Jones. Daniel Jones will be playing in this game. So there's a lot of interesting props on the board for sure. They just added the Giants uh, receptions props before I started this video. I didn't see too much value in the Giants reception props. There's a tiny bit of value. I think Sills has value if I'm not sure over two receptions, but it's not been, it's nothing crazy. Like I'm not personally playing it at the moment, but rush attempts right here. You have 13 for Dylan and 18.5 for Barkley. Uh, you guys take a look at Dylan right here. He had 17 against New England and what was, you know, not, you know, just Green Bay couldn't put the ball through the air last game. Um, and that, that's kind of why Dylan had 17 attempts. Uh, it, although Aaron Jones, he kind of killed it on attempts too. Both those guys run for their lives out there. Um, but anyways, Barkley, 18.5 rushing attempts, which is insane. I mean, I feel, I feel like the Giants are just going to give it to the, the ball to Barkley all game. Uh, I think Barkley uh, rushing yards is actually really, really interesting at 77 and a half because I saw him at like 85 and a half on sports books. So again, just more value over on prize picks. If you guys are not on prize picks, you guys got to join, man. Link is down in the description below. Available in most states. Use my code. That'll get you guys 100% deposit match up to $100, like I said. But rushing touchdowns, you guys take a look here. Derek Henry, Leonard Fournette, Nick Chubb at half a, rush, half a rushing touchdown. Nothing I've been interested in there too, too much. Um, but yeah, I mean, Barkley's got a little bit of value to him, I will say. Rodgers, one and a half rushing yards. Yeah, Daniel Jones at 27 and a half, which is interesting with him being as banged up as he is. Although he is coming off of 68 and 79 rushing yard games. Green Bay is known for really letting quarterbacks run as well, I will say. So, you know, Daniel Jones, I don't want to play his over, um, you know, because he's banged up. But, you know, if he was healthy, I'd probably think about that for sure. But uh, yeah, Rodgers passing yards at 231. Daniel Jones at 188 for uh, passing yards. He had 71 against Chicago, although, of course, he did get injured. Uh, 196 against Dallas right there. But I don't know, man. Uh, I'm, I'm not playing anything Aaron Rodgers. This is an interesting spot, though. 234, 255, and 251 against Chicago, Tampa Bay, and New, uh, New England. So that could be a potential over right there if you just take a look at the hit rate. Uh, Giants defense, I don't think is anything super, super special, especially when facing a guy like Aaron Rodgers. But uh, we'll see, man. Uh, I, I'm definitely interested in a lot of Barkley, man. I think they're just going to hand the ball to Barkley. They're going to throw the ball to Barkley. I think they're going to do just everything Saquon Barkley in this game. Uh, that's what I think a lot of people are thinking, though. The sports books know that people are thinking that. So I don't know. But there is still value on this because I think he's at 85 and a half on different sports books. So I've seen a little bit of value in Barkley right there. But uh, what else can we take a look at here? Field goal made. Mason Crosby is a minus 140 to go over one and a half, although the hit rate is not very good at all. I will say, I believe he is two, uh, yeah, two for two this season, or two and two this season is what I meant. Two for four this season. Uh, it's zero against Minnesota, two against Chicago, two against New England. So, I don't know. That's an uh, in interesting spot right there, I guess. For Mason Crosby, one and a half field goals made. Again, he's a minus 140, but I personally will not be playing that. Uh, very, very interesting spot, though. You guys take a look at Fantasy Square as well. There's just so much price picks has. Definitely recommend joining if you guys are not already. Check out the Patreon if you guys want. The link is down in the description below. So, really, three things. Sign up for prize picks if you guys are not already. Link is down in the description below. Patreon link is down in the description below if you guys are interested in joining that. We swept the Thursday night football board. We've been sweeping a lot of Thursday night and Monday night football slates. And also subscribe to the channel and leave a like on the video. And I will see you guys in the next one. Peace out, boys. Hopefully we cash. See you guys the next time. Peace out, boys.